Good morning, sir. How are we today, sir? Fine. And you? Radiant, sir. Radiant. <coughs> Ooh, that is a lovely suit, isn't it, sir? Yes. <laughs> yeah, it's Ooh. nice. Yeah. Suit you, sir. Suit like that. Ooh. <laughs> do you want one off the peg, sir? Or do you want one made up? Uh, well, I'm looking for something a bit smart. I'm starting a new job. Oh, congratulations, sir. Will you be having your own secretary, sir? Uh, yes. Yes, I think so. Will you be giving it to her, sir? <laughs> Sorry? Your secretary, sir. Will you be giving it to her? I'm not sure I understand. Have you thought of a colour, sir? We have some excellent blue serge. Uh, yes, a uh, blue or, or, or a grey. Oh, suit you, sir. Oh, the ladies <laughs> like a man in a suit, don't they, sir? <laughs> Were you out with the lady last night, sir? I, yes, I was, as a matter of fact. Did she want it, sir? <laughs> Beg your pardon? The lady you were out with last night, sir, did she want it, sir? Oh, suit you, sir. <laughs> oh, uh, 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 arms. Sorry, sir, didn't mean a thing. Trying to make conversation. Won't say another word. <laughs> this lady you were out with last <laughs> night, sir. Yes. Known her long? Uh, yes, about four years. She's my fiance. Does she want it, sir? <laughs> you what? Your fiance. Does she want it, sir? Is she a pale girl, sir? Doe-eyed, sir. Like a frightened deer in a woodland glade, sir. <laughs> cornered by the hounds. Oh. Does she make this sort of noise, sir? Ah! 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 Goodbye. Does she look over her shoulder at you, sir, like this? Ah! <laughs> Hello. Hello. How are we today, oh, sir? Fine, thank you. You? Radiant, sir. Radiant. <laughs> what can we do for you, sir? Well, I'm. Well, we're getting married, and I need a suit. What, you and this lady here, sir? Are you sure, sir? Have you really thought this one through, sir? Oh, I think so. <laughs> Very well, sir. Suits you, sir. We just wanted something simple, you know, maybe a grey suit. What sort of suit are we looking for, sir? <laughs> yes, a grey... Oh, grey, sir. Oh, suit you, sir. We thought maybe a morning suit. <laughs> Perhaps a morning suit, sir. Oh, suit you, sir. Sir would look good in a morning suit. Big, handsome man like yourself. Oh. <laughs> Expect you're plagued by them, aren't you, sir? <laughs> the ladies. Shouldn't be surprised if it gets a bit inconvenient for you, sir. Sheer volume of ladies plaguing you. <laughs> <laughs> Will you be giving her a seeing to tonight, sir? Pardon? The young lady, sir. Will you be giving her a seeing to, sir? I don't think that's any of your business. No, of course not, sir. How clever of you to have noticed, sir. <laughs> yes, really, Ken, it's quite inappropriate. None of our business if he's up all night rogering the tart, is it, sir? <laughs> is it? I think we should try that other place. Would sir like to sit down? <laughs> Does sir have a honeymoon hotel booked? Well, I do. Oh, will it be the bridal suite, sir? Oh, I do hope so, sir. Will it be the bridal? No, he'll just hold her by the ears. <laughs> Sorry, sir. Old joke, sir, just slipped it in, sir. You'll be slipping it in tonight, won't you, sir? <laughs> Oh, suit you. Suit you, sir. Can I watch, sir? May I take pictures, sir? Oh, suit you. Suit you, sir. Oh, go on, let them. Oh, suit you, madam. Good morning, sir. How are we today, sir? Oh, fine, thanks. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Dear me, no. I'm oh, sorry. Sir's been a trifle rude, hasn't, sir? The gentleman asked you how you were and you failed to ask him back sir oh i'm sorry how are you radiant sir radiant what can i do for you sir uh want a sort of summer suit something light you know oh summer suit sir oh suit you sir ken <laughs> summer suit easy drop easy drop is it easy drop ken <laughs> suit you sir oh <laughs> sir will look the bee's knees in a summer suit oh picture you now sir strolling through the park your <laughs> cream suit fresh crisp, flowing beautifully as you push your lady wife up against a tree and give her a jolly good seeing to. <laughs> what did you say then? Give her a jolly good seeing to, sir. You're taking the piss? There's no problem, Kenny. Yeah, there is a problem. Why, sir? Doesn't the lady want it, sir? Doesn't she want it, sir? Oh. Have you tried tying her up, sir? 
Soup too. Get me the manager. I want to see the manager. You want the manager, do you, madam? Yes, I do. You want me to lose my job, do you? I don't care. Very well, then. Mr. Hobson? Madam's done it now, madam. Fine. Can I help? Are you the manager? Yes. This man insulted me. Was it done with any style? He made an obscene suggestion regarding me and my husband. I see. Was there by any chance a tree involved? There was, as a matter of fact. I see. This isn't the first time this has happened. Oh. Did you make these suggestions, Kenneth? Afraid I did, sir. Yeah, then laughing, boy, is just as I tire up. Tire up, sir? Yeah. Ooh! Tire up! <laughs> Ooh, suits you! Ooh, up against a tree! Very back and alien, sir. Ooh. Was there a suggestion of a blind? Ooh. A Ooh. suggestion of handcuffs? Ah! Suits you! Ice cubes! Ah! Oh. Prince Albert! Is that the Ooh. noise you make, madam? Oh! Prince oh. Albert, sir! Oh. 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 You want it, madam? You want it? What <laughs> Oh, suit you, sir. Suit you, sir. Oh, suit you, sir. Should we go to our club, Kenneth? For gentlemen, behind closed doors, sir. Suit you. I'll put the shop to bed, sir. Do it now, sir. Suit you, sir. Suit you, sir. Oh. <laughs> These are nice. Oh, they are, aren't they, madam? Oh. Suit you, 100% artificial fibres, no danger of shrinking. Uh, right. Mm, perhaps, sir, would prefer something a little more beige. A nice dull brown. Oh. Suit you. <laughs> yes. The earthy tones of done. Uh, I rather like grey. Really, Tom, you're such an old stick in the well, mud. I know what I like. I'm sure you do, sir. Man of your <laughs> age. People should respect your age and experience, shouldn't they, sir? Quite. Mm. A lot of people write off the elderly, don't they, sir? Say they have no relevance anymore. <laughs> They're in the twilight of their years. Yes, all right. Feeble-minded. Oh, right. Yes, but you're still fit and virile, aren't you, sir? Oh. You're still young at heart. I expect you give the wife a good seeing to every now and then, don't you, sir? <laughs> Suits you. A lot of people labour under the delusion that old people don't make the beast with two backs anymore. <laughs> Not you, though, eh, sir? I expect you're at it morning, noon and night, aren't you, sir? Oh, suit you. I expect he's a pest, isn't he, madam? Some nights you'd rather read a book, wouldn't you? Oh, yes, I do like to read. Oh, she's a wild one, isn't she, sir? <laughs> a mink, a monkey, a moaning messalina. <laughs> Mind you, I expect you still sometimes hanker after a young body, don't you, sir? After all, you were young once, weren't you, sir? Hmm? You know there are girls of 16 out there, don't you, sir? Doing it. Oh. Suit you, sir. One last fling before you pop your clogs. You should be ashamed of yourself, sir, you randy old goat. These hankies are rather jolly. Have you tried drugs to heighten sexual awareness, sir? Have you tried violence, madam? How about these slacks? No, oh, I don't like any of these. Come on. Thank you. We're not getting through, Ken. Press on, Kenneth. Have you tried massage, sir? With oils and unguents? Powder fire horn? Latex foundations, madam? Tiger's gonads? Poppers? Bull's pizzle? Hello. Good evening, sir. You're looking radiant tonight, sir. Thank you. Can I get a drink for you and your <clears throat> wife, sir? Uh, this is my wife. Of course she is, sir. Suit you, sir. They always are, aren't they, sir? No, she is. That's what sir always says, sir. No, I've never been here before. Oh, I see. Forgive me, sir. I understand. That's all right. May I recommend the halibut? <laughs> May I say, sir, you're a very lucky man. Your wife's a very beautiful lady indeed. Oh, suit you, sir. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. I expect you can't keep your hands off her, can you, sir? I bet you bang her brains out, don't you, sir? <laughs> I expect after a heavy session, she looks like this in the morning, doesn't she, sir? <laughs> I beg your pardon? The cochlear Newberg is very good today, madam. Oh, uh, what's that? Scallops. Oh. Do you like shellfish, madam? Mm. Oh, oysters. Suit you. Mm. Oh, do you chew or swallow? I swallow. <laughs> Suit you, sir. <laughs> so what about these scallops, then? The tenderest, juiciest scallops, dropped into foam and butter, mm. cooked lovingly and gently so they remain firm, mm. plump and pinky white. Ooh. Oh, drizzle on a little brandy, Ooh. some Madeira, oh, mm. creme fraiche, mm. truffles, oh, suit you. Can we move on to the dessert, please? I'm already there, sir. <laughs> the frisson de chocolat, Ooh. layers of wafer-thin, silky Belgian chocolate, Ooh. Oh, mm. cappuccino ice cream, uh. double whipped cream, caramel, Ooh. oh, Grand Marnier, oh, mm. oh, topped with candied black cherries and a dark, mm. dark chocolate Ooh. sauce. Oh, Ooh. suit you. Oh, yes. <laughs> what about today's special then? 
tongue, sir. <laughs> oh, a sports jacket, sir. Oh, suits you. Yes. Suits suit you, yeah. Mm. The ladies like a well-turned-out chap in a sports jacket, don't they, sir? Yes. Very manly. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Do you have a preference, sir? Oh, I don't know. Um, this, this one looks quite nice. <laughs> no, I mean in women, sir. <laughs> Do you have a preference, sir? Do you prefer a slow-witted girl, sir? Dim, bright of aspect, but with no discernible intellect, sir. <laughs> They're more fun in many ways, aren't they, sir? Oh, suit you. They may not bring much to the party, sir, but they certainly enjoy themselves when they're there. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm married, actually. My commiseration, sir. <laughs> oh, suits me fine. Oh, suits you, sir. Do you have an open marriage, sir? Do you have an open wife, sir? What? Find anything you like? Well, there's this. Well, what do you think? Really, sir? <laughs> <laughs> She's a woman, sir. She can't be expected to look decorative and think. You can't talk to me like that. Oh, thank God for the ladies, eh, sir? Where would we be without them, sir? Bless them, I say, sir. Bless them. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, she's a fiery one, sir. Eh? Quite a handful. I bet you fair knock yourself out trying to keep her entertained between the sheets, sir. <laughs> Do you really care, sir, when it boils down to it, sir? Do you really care if the lady enjoys herself? I mean, let's face it, sir. Sexual congress is simply the act of procreation tarted up a bit, isn't it, sir? <laughs> isn't it, sir? Come on, Janet, have enough. Come on. Ever been to a cockfight, sir? Hmm? <laughs> Two proud cocks, peak condition, advancing, menacingly, erect, ready to do battle. Hmm? Brutal, sir. Brutal, but strangely compelling. They never give up, sir. Suit you, sir. Suit you. Do you like the skinny supermodel, sir? They're all right to look at, aren't they, sir? But with the more old-fashioned, voluptuous type of woman, it's a more comfortable ride, isn't it, sir? <laughs> the Bentley approach, rather than the Morgan, sir. Do you mind? I'm trying to watch the show. Ken's got a point, though, sir, hasn't he, sir? Thanks, Ken. I bet you'd like to be up there, sir, wouldn't you? Hmm? Snuffling around like a pig looking for a truffle, sir. <laughs> Suit you, suit you, sir. Hmm? Linda Evangelista, Cindy Crawford, Naomi Campbell, the other one. <laughs> Which one would you like to take home for the weekend, sir? Wrapped up in pink ribbon. <laughs> suit you, suit you, sir. I'd like them all, sir. Imagine, sir, Elle McPherson, the body, in your bathroom, <laughs> cleaning her teeth, sir, bending over your sink in the morning, sir. <laughs> Sweet, sir. Oh, suit you, sir. Oh, oh, sir. Quick, sir. Look, sir. Silk, sir. Oh, queen of fabrics. Mmm. Imagine, sir. Next to the skin. Next to your lady friend's skin. You wouldn't bother taking it off, sir, would you? You just nose it to one side. <laughs> Rip it off with your teeth, sir. Oh, suit you, sir. Oh. Will you shut up? <laughs> Are you a buyer, sir, or are you just here for a wank? <laughs> for Jesus Christ, our Saviour, was born on Christmas Day. Hello, sir. <laughs> Merry Christmas to you, sir. How are you, sir? I'm very well, thank you. Oh, uh, and you? Radiant, sir. <laughs> Radiant, sir. It is, after all, Christmas. Do you have any wives, sir? Or daughters, sir? Or pets? Well, I am married. Well, would you wish them a very Merry Christmas from us, sir? And a Happy New Year, sir, to your wives, your daughters, and your very many pets. <laughs> and remember, sir, a puppy isn't just for Christmas, but for life. Oh, a puppy? Suit you, sir. Oh. Does your wife maintain eye contact, sir, throughout, sir, with that sort of serious look, does she, sir? <laughs> doesn't get any better than that, sir, does it, sir? Oh, suits you, sir. I beg your pardon. Good King Wenceslas looked out on the feast of Stephen as the snow lay round about, deep and crisp and even. Oh, deep and crisp and even, sir, suits you. <laughs> Experiment with food, sir. Have you bought your wife a battery-operated Christmas present, sir? Oh. 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 
Right, why don't you two ding just go on merrily on high? Oh, in heaven the bells are ringing. Will you be dinging and donging merrily on high tonight, sir? Will you be ringing your wife's bell, sir? Will you be going like a clapper, sir, in a frenzy of sweat and hair, sir? Oh, oh suit you, sir. sir. Oh, you have got 30 seconds to clear off before I call the police. Oh, sir, you're like a rutting stag, aren't you? <laughs> suit you, sir. Ho, ho, ho. Goodbye. <laughs> I've seen you somewhere before, sir. I'm an actor. I have done one or two commercials. We don't watch television, sir. <laughs> well, I have done some Shakespeare, although you probably wouldn't have... Uh... Oh, that's right, sir. I've seen your Hamlet, haven't I, sir? <laughs> it's only a small production, sir, but your Hamlet really stood out, sir. <laughs> have you seen Kenneth Branagh? <laughs> yes. Oh, Kenneth Branagh is an extraordinary Hamlet, isn't it, sir? Oh. Quite exquisite, sir. Oh, the things he does with his Hamlet beggars belief, sir. <laughs> I thought I'd seen every type of Hamlet there was till I saw Kenneth. <laughs> so, you, sir. You don't find it too long? No. I like a long Hamlet. <laughs> you, sir? Oh, it was even longer than Olivier's. Ah, yes. But when I saw Olivier's Hamlet on stage, it was perfect. <laughs> the audience gasped in wonder at it, sir. I didn't think Kenneth Branagh had the physical presence to carry off such an enormous Hamlet, sir. <laughs> but he did, Ken. And apparently, it brought tears to Kate Winslet's eyes. <laughs> suit you, sir. Oh, suit you. Goodness. You have got a big penis, haven't you? <laughs> This is Philip Kenneth. He's the new boy. We need to show him the ropes. He's not very experienced. I'm sure you're very experienced, aren't you, young sir? I don't know about that. Oh, suit you, young sir. <laughs> now, young sir, these are jackets, these are shirts, and this, of course, is a trouser. Oh! <laughs> It's not too difficult, is it, sir? No, I suppose not. Hmm. The ladies like a man in a trouser, don't they, sir? And out of a trouser. <laughs> I expect you're in and out of your trousers all day long, aren't you, sir? <laughs> oh, oh, do you know the correct way to measure a man, sir? Um. This is your tape measure. Look after it, for it will be your best friend, your lover and your mother. <laughs> Always remember to warm the end. <sighs> You don't want to go in cold. <laughs> then jam it up nice and snug and bobs your uncle. <laughs> and fanny's your aunt. <laughs> Are you married, young sir? No. But you do have a girlfriend, I warrant. Fine, handsome young man like yourself. I bet you're beating off the ladies with a stick, aren't you, young sir? Oh! Beating off the ladies, sir. Oh, with a stick, sir. Oh, suit you. Oh, do you ever have occasion to beat yourself off, young sir? <laughs> with a stick. I don't know about that, but I've got a girlfriend. Is she a big girl, sir? I'm sorry. <laughs> when she takes off her top, are you reminded of the opening scenes from Raiders of the Lost Ark? <laughs> Only with two boulders instead of one, <laughs> young sir. <laughs> She's sort of normal. She's a sort of animal, sir. Oh, <laughs> a scratching, kicking, moaning, bucking, writhing animal. Oh, does she sometimes go too far, sir? Does she burst you with nettles and then need heavy sedation, young sir? <laughs> I'm sorry, I really don't like talking about my private life, so if you don't mind. Certainly, young sir. You're fired. <laughs> Oh, Betty Swallocks. <laughs> Betty Swallocks. Sorry, I don't know. No, sir, I was using a spoonerism, sir. <laughs> Betty Swallocks. You were walking in a manner which suggests that your scrotum is stuck to your legs, sir. <laughs> well, it's, uh, it is a hot day. Hot, sticky and damp. Oh, suits you, sir. Oh, a gentleman shouldn't be walking about in weather like this, should he, sir? It's not good for the health, is it, sir? No. Brings them out, doesn't it, sir? <laughs> the hot weather. What? The ladies, sir. Brings them out, doesn't it, sir? Oh! Where do they come from, sir? With their skimpy tops and their skimpy bottoms and their bare midriffs, sir? Oh! It's Quim City out there. <laughs> oh, 
Suit you, suit you, sir. It's a sign of the modern independent lady, isn't it, sir? A lack of clothing. And is it my imagination, sir? Or are they all pierced these days, sir? Oh! <laughs> On a hot summer's day like today, sir, don't you sometimes feel like falling to your knees and shouting, Thank God for women's liberation! <laughs> Good morning, sir. How are we today? Blooming, thank you. And you? Radiant, sir. <laughs> Radiant. Good, good. Now, I'm looking for a suit. Not too formal, not too casual. Lightweight, not too flimsy. A neutral colour, but not too dull. Oh, you know your own mind, don't you, sir? <laughs> yes, I suppose I do. Oh, a suit, sir. Suit you. Is that all you're after, sir? Yes, after all. I have enough socks. <laughs> <laughs> have you ever thought about going at it full pelt with a tranny, sir? <gasps> a female, a man, woman, man. <laughs> Why do you ask? Just as a matter of interest, sir. I've taken interest in that sort of thing. I see. And you, sir? Have you ever sampled the unique delights of a lady man? <laughs> you think that's none of your business, sir. You're quite right. Now, this suit. <laughs> Yes, uh, a suit. Uh, these were tailored in Thailand. Sir. Anything goes out there, doesn't it, sir? <laughs> Have you spent much time out there, sir, in Bangkok? <laughs> now, Kenneth, he's a live one. Mm? <laughs> the sex capital of the world, sir. Mm? But don't you feel grubby after a while, sir? Yes, I generally feel I need a thorough cleansing after I've mired myself in the addictive world of pornography, prostitution and perverse sex games. <laughs> one always hates oneself, don't you think? Well, uh... One feels the need to reacquaint oneself with the finer things in life, with purity and love and innocence. And then it's down with the trousers, out with the old chap, and come on, ladies, come on, gentlemen, come on, you trannies, fruits of the forest, satyrs, come slide down the greasy pole of my neutrality, and I'll bring the chickens. Are you enjoying the trousers, sir? Yes, they're, uh, they're very comfortable. They're just a little, little long. Oh, suit you, sir. Oh, Step over here, would you, sir? Right. See the X on the floor, sir? Yep. That's right. X marks the spot, doesn't it, sir? Right. Oh, suit you. <laughs> Turn around this way, sir. Yes. Face this way. Right. That's right, sir. Okay. You're not nervous, are you, sir? Um, no. Good. Put your hands in your pockets, sir. Right. And have a good jiggle about, sir. <laughs> Go on, sir. Fiddle, sir. Jiggle, sir. Manhandle your manhandle, sir. <laughs> suit you, suit you, sir. I'm not sure I exactly. Come on, know. sir. We all do it, don't we? We all like to have a good rummage, don't we, sir? <laughs> Some days it's essential, isn't it, sir? A spot of genital husbandry. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> I didn't think that was necessary. It's the only way to see if they fit, sir. Oh, see yes. if they're comfy. See if there's room for manoeuvre, sir. <laughs> Trust us. We're, We're tailors. <laughs> OK. Go on, sir, really stir that soup. Right. That's it, sir. Don't be shy, sir. <gasps> Blimey, it's like the World Snooker Championship. <laughs> Go on, sir, rearrange the three-piece. Right. Oh. Come on, sir, ring those bells. <laughs> Manipulate the meat and two veg, sir. Juggle those plums. Oh. Oh. Suit, suit you, sir. <laughs> now, we did video that, sir. You what? We videoed it. <laughs> Not that we would ever dream of showing it on a TV screen in the shop window on the high street, sir. Busy, busy high street, sir. Where it might attract the attention of some of your friends, or your family, or your work colleagues. Would you like to open an account with us, sir? And then we'll say no more about it. <laughs> I'll fetch the easy to complete paperwork, Ken. Suit you. <laughs> Can I help you, sir? Yes, um, I've got a charity ball at the weekend, and I wonder if you could recommend a suit. Oh, a charity ball, sir. Suit you, sir. Will there be dancing, sir? I would imagine so, yes. Oh, the old dances are the best, aren't they, sir? <laughs> the Charleston, the Foxtrot, the Tango, the Gay Gordon, sir. The Maiden's Surprise. <laughs> the French Girl's Button. The Salesman's Hornpipe. The Fishwife's Gratification. The Plucked Chicken. The shaved spatchcock. The surprised sheep. <laughs> the slippery chap. The lazy beaver. <laughs> the hairy treat. Look out, the lady. My sacket is a swinging. Well, I don't dance, actually, because I've got a dodgy knee. What about the old songs, then, eh, sir? <laughs> oh, Dolly, you give me the horn. <laughs> My Johnny sailed over the ocean and I'm left here on the spin dryer with not but a picture of Ray Fines and a sponge finger, sir. <laughs> oh, suit you, suit you, sir.
Sorry, sir, I was just cupping an imaginary pair of breasts. <laughs> Good morning, sir. How are we today, sir? Fine. I'm fine, thank you. Radiant. Radiant, as you English people like to say. I was looking for a, uh, something in a very traditional British suit. You're an American, aren't you, sir? Yes. You've been here long? A couple of days. Have you boned anyone yet, sir? <laughs> this suit, sir. A pinstripe or a tweed? I don't know. Uh, maybe... Perhaps a pinstripe. Okay. <gasps> Yes, sir. I can see it now, sir. You in your new pinstripe suit, the picture of English elegance and authority, sir, as you take your old fellow out, sir. Oh, and give it to some dirty little bit of rough. Oh, under a bridge or behind a railway siding, sir. Oh, suit you, sir. Oh, listen, you know, maybe I... Are you perchance an American, sir? <laughs> Been here long, sir? A couple of days. Banged anyone yet, sir? <laughs> Please, I just... I... Because you don't usually hang around, do you, sir? I remember in the war, you Yanks were in like a shot. I don't mean in the actual fighting. You were a couple of years too late for that, sir. I mean in the humping. That's right, sir. You'd step down off the boat, wouldn't you? Wipe the vom from your uniform. And before you could say, God bless America, you'd be slipping it to every English rose under the age of 70, sir. Oh. I actually I wasn't even born. <laughs> no, sir. Neither was I. It's just an image I like to conjure up every now and then. The fine, young, strong American buck and the frail, delicate English beauty entwined in a sexual ballet choreographed by the devil himself, sir. Oh! That's a nice image, isn't it? <gasps> oh! oh. <laughs> no, this is... Yeah, right. You must have needed some prize bazookas in your time, <laughs> as you Americans like to call them, sir. What, 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 have you ever added it up, sir? Must be a bewildering number. Oh. Gushing torrent of young ladies. An avalanche of quim. A mountain of minge. <laughs> Cornucopia of... Suit you, sir. Oh, oh <laughs> suit you, sir. Oh, oh. Now, sir, single or double-breasted? Oh, I do apologise, sir. That sounded like a smutty innuendo, didn't it? <laughs> like a bit of smut, sir. Oh, suit you, sir. Suit you, sir. Oh, suit you. Oh, suit you. Suit you, oh, suit you. Oh, suit you. Oh, Will you just build me a fucking suit? <laughs> well, sir, we'll measure you up. Do you like being measured up, sir? Oh, go on, Kenny, sir. Oh, suit you, suit you, sir. Get him, Kenny, sir. Oh, that's it, sir. That's it, sir. Oh, come on, sir. Join us, sir. Come over, sir. Come on, sir. Oh, sir. Oh, suit you, sir. Hello, sir. Were you out with a lady last night, sir? Oh, did she want it, sir? Oh, did she, sir? Oh, 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 suit you, sir. Oh. No, I'm gay. Kenneth, help. <laughs> I'm hiding. <laughs> I'm hiding, Ken, in a very secret place, and I'm not coming out. <laughs> I'm not coming out either. <laughs> <laughs> Tomorrow, 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 Tomor